Hello folks, this is Mike Kazala, and here we have Private Snafu in Rumors. A, a story about spreading untruths and speculation. And uh, we talk a moment about Snafu in general. That uh, these films were largely written at the first motion picture unit. That Ted Geisel, better known as Dr. Sooth, and... Tony Eastman would be later beloved kids author. But uh, something pertinent to this picture too, um, Maurice Noble was working at the same unit doing story sketches. And I think there'll be some evidence of that in this film. And of course the dialogue in this cartoon has real Dr. Seussian overtones in it. I believe this is Ted Pierce doing a lot of the narration in this cartoon. <laughs> nice close up and cut back. But, uh... I do like that. You know, you've got these little machines in your head with gloves. Yes. <laughs> but this, that's the visual metaphor for a real life phenomenon. <laughs> you like they have him look at the camera before he shoots his mouth off. This is, uh, these silhouettes are just Jack Bradbury here, who's working for Frizz Freeling. Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't mention Frizz Freeling, who directed this cartoon. I like that a lot of the cartoon has uh, black skies in it for a good graphic effect. Uh, this here is Jerry Shinicky animating. And are you going to stand for having your baloney lecture you? This is an example of a very Seuss like creature. <laughs> I do like that they let the animation lead the camera move in this scene, that makes it look a little more dizzying. If you look at all the cr crazy camera angles, and oh, this scene, by the way, is Gil Turner. Uh, who would end up doing an awful lot of comic book work as well as animation. But you can see that in this particular cartoon, just in the layouts, uh, you could see the influence from Maurice Noble's story sketches. But these jet black sets really give this a lot of graphic punch. Uh, Doing pans where you're going from foreground to background is also very effective. Uh, some judicious use of airbrushing. <laughs> the whole camp has rumoritis now. <laughs> I think it's some more of Jack Bradbury's animation here. Thank you. Thank you. The end. Very cool. This is a very cool cartoon.